Coachella, I have the distinct, nay, the honor, the pleasure <laughs> of introducing you to Greta Van Fleet. Boys, a rock and roll band on this couch. That's what I live for. Yeah. The couch? Surprise is still standing. Shit, we gotta get off of this. <laughs> I'm so sorry, they just left. They got way too intimidated. <laughs> Guys, we have a lot to unpack in this very short time. I have a lot of questions to ask you, right, so I'm going to jump in. Are you ready? <laughs> okay, the first, yeah. cheers, boys. First, first Coachella, cheers. you go from playing yeah. the Troubadour cheers. to the Coachella cheers. on a double EP. Where's the All right. Mm. Cheers. All right. Lovely. So. All right. Start, I'm going to dive straight in. Are you ready? Yeah. All right. Please do. What is the, what is the pressure like? Because we all know there's been a lot of talk of you guys being the new Led Zeppelin compared to Zeppelin a lot. You even got props from Robert Plant, and oh. no one gets props. Which is lovely, Plant. yeah. I mean, <laughs> that was a great um, reach. To, to, I mean, I think it, it for us, it probably feels about the same way as it would for them doing what they were doing. You know, it's kind of a natural thing, and you go and you go on stage, and you write your music, and you record it, and you, and you do your thing. Yeah. It doesn't seem to be that that we feel that there there is a concern or a cause for concern. You know, I think it's just. I have zero concerns. Those. I'm gonna let you know that right now. <laughs> okay. I'm living for it. Yeah. So I don't know. It's just kind of one of those things. It's like, well, you can do it, so why not? I mean, and why, why, why be, you know, uptight the whole time? You know, it doesn't make any sense. If you seem like Robert Plant, why not just sing, you know? Yeah, well, that's right. We were always going, well, worse things could have happened, you know? <laughs> He's an incredible singer, you know? Okay, so boys, tell me all together, what's the pressure like? I mean, you go from playing, like, like I said before, you go from playing Troubadour to Coachella, it's not, it's walking not, on the stage. It's not that bad. Honestly. No, the pressure's yeah. pretty nice. You just smoke a cigarette or two. Uh, <laughs> I vomit before know. every show. Yeah? No, I don't. No, we just get up and play, we're like, yeah, rock and roll, and then we get off, you know? Yeah, no, That's the most rock and roll thing I've heard all That's day, boys. All right, really? tell me your take on rock and roll. Ooh, well, that's a good question. Rock and roll, and roll itself has <laughs> got to be like a personified version of it, like every genre. A every lot, a lot genre, of genre. Everything. Blues, funk, soul, you know, R&B, everything. Yeah. yeah. It incorporates yeah. all those elements. I think Country? It just yeah. breaks them to 11. Yes. Yeah. I think that was the thing. Is like initially, you know, when rock and roll first became, you know, that genre-specific thing that was tied to rock and roll, it really was kind of disseminated from all those traditional... You know, roots music of yeah. country blues. and yeah. blues, mainly blues and folk, and you know all those things. And it's like, yeah, of course, that's what it became a personified version of those elements. And except, I think that's what it really except is. rock and roll is no. more than just a genre; it's a lifestyle. Hey, that's my man. It's really hey. just a lifestyle. Yeah, if we can't lose its intellectual properties either, that would Mike be a shame. <laughs> yeah. It's true. There's, I think, rock and roll forces change. It's a catalyst for change. I think you. It, it makes people think about things. Yeah. It gives it, give it a second thought, you know? Yeah. Another thing that makes it's it so sort of intellectual. A substance. Right? Yeah. A substance. It's a very well thought out thing. All right, going back to rock and roll as a lifestyle, what does that mean to you guys now? I mean, you're living in the rock and roll moment. You've had a crazy year. You've been on the come up all year. Yeah. So, like, what is the rock and roll lifestyle for Greta Van Fleet? What are you doing? That's, are you it's really excessive. I mean, <laughs> everything and not nothing. It's so chromatic, I, I'm, I'm blinded by the whole thing. You have, a, you have a hard time finding words. Yeah, it's yeah. it's really just transcendental. It's, it's, it's transcendent. It's it, transcendent. it's experimental. It's uh, preconceived. Ooh. And it's busy Ooh. as hell. Ooh. And it's busy as hell. <laughs> yeah. Also, tell me about your style, boys. Where do you get most of your stuff? Good. Thrift shops. Yes. Yeah. I yeah. Knew Around the world. We, we, we travel and shop. This is, this is me group hugging all of you. She's in the okay. band now. Yeah, no, this shirt came from Target in the little boys section. Right. That's fantastic. So, that's, awesome. that's fantastic. Jeans, Goodwill. Nice. Amazing. Good. Nice. Coach all well style put is together. Looking. Thank you. Yeah. And as are you gentlemen. Okay, what do you what do you look for when you go in? Like what's the treasure? What's the find? Ooh. That's Ooh. the Anything, thing. You're not looking yeah. for anything. Yeah. Yeah. You're not looking for anything. The treasure is what you, you don't intend to seek, I suppose. The Something treasure will kinda... find you. Exactly. That's just shit. Oh, that's wow. just shit. Wow. Isn't that... Is that right? That was so cheesy, but it was so true. That was the little boy. <laughs> <laughs> was the little boy <laughs> emanating It'll be on that hanger, that was, just uh, glowing. That was fantastic. Calling your true. name. True, and you know some, when you see something oh, and you love it, you're like, I love this, and you buy it. You know that and great feeling when you're flipping through at Goodwill, and then the right thing comes along, you're like, that's it. That's the one. And you look, and it's like three forty nine, and you're like, <laughs> yeah, That's one of the greatest feelings Great. ever. It's true. It's true. It is. It's like, is it worth it? Ah. It totally yes. is. Yes. I love when you can go. Oh, that's that's just gonna that's gonna fit in it. You know, you like it. That's perfect. You know it's gonna. You know what's fit. not good is when it you know, doesn't fit like, in your luggage. 
way home. Oh, man. Oh, then you just, then you just keister it. That's true, but on yeah. the, you guys have been on the road a lot, so... Oh, wait, I mean, I've, guys, I could talk to you forever. I want you to know that right now. Okay, <laughs> so, so tell me this. Long a long time. I know we've talked about some deep things, what we think about rock and roll, the pressure of being Greta Von Fleet after, you know, being compared to Zeppelin. What tour games are you playing on the road? Hmm. There's got to be a tour game. Tour games. Uh, golf. Golf. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. A very we serious do like golfer. golf. We like to golf. I prefer it's shotgun amazing. golf myself. I have a, Ooh. yeah. Uh-huh. Tour games. All but about no, it. seriously, though, it's, it's an important thing because on tour, things can get very stressful very fast. Sure. And you need this way to keep it fun and wind down. We've been saying lately, fun first. Because if you don't, yeah, that was if you don't fun have fun first. first, then it just becomes a job. Sure. You know, we never want to be like, oh, man, we got to go to work. We gotta then get you out lose a creative element because there's no, there's no childlike energy. There's no... Absolutely. I don't know. I think we really away from you. Yeah. You I think growing up is just a social construct. Yeah. You know, creative we identity. That's so we were wrong. Identity. 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 We were you look at that camera right there. Sweet. You look at it right we there and you tell us. Childhood. Growing up fun is first. a social construct. Remember fun first. Fun first. We are Listen just a bunch of children. You know. Listen to rock and roll, Coachella. Tell us. Listen to rock and roll. Listen to rock and roll. Listen to rock and roll. I mean, you could be in a button-up collared shirt. You're still, you know, still like a trampoline. Great event, please. Thank you so much for sitting down with. Me. Gosh, Everybody go listen to a double EP, not an album yet, so we'll be it's looking not, forward to that. It's not an album. It's not well, out yet. Yeah. <laughs> we we spent a lot of time on it. It's going to be fantastic. Uh, yeah, well I believe it, boys. Thanks for sitting down with me. Of course. Thank you so much for having us. Cheers. 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 Cheers.